Hey folks, High Country Cal Punk. Alright, well, um, finally got to see the endocrinologist after five months of waiting. Um, the whole purpose of waiting is uh, I've already had my thyroid removed and all my parathyroid um, glands removed. Um, I had papillary cancer, it had gotten into lymph nodes, so the next step for me is ablation with radioactive iodine 131. I'm literally hair of the dog that bit me. Um, now I'm on day eight of my preparation for the radioactive iodine. Now we waited five months to go see this one doctor, and who's a fantastic doctor, but he had a line on some medication that it would only be three days of starving the iodine absorbing tissues in my body so that they're ready to absorb the radioactive iodine and, you know, die. Um, but Due to the advanced nature of my cancer, um, I guess it's stage three, it's not papillary and thyroid cancer is not listed like leukemia and stuff like that, but basically stage three um, and my age and other factors, the quick fix isn't really a good option for me. Um, I have to go the more traditional route of starving the iodine loving tissues um, to the point where they are going to absorb any kind of iodine they could find. Okay, I am on day eight now of not taking my thyroid um, hormone replacement pills. Um, things are getting weird already. My vision is a little skewed. I can't focus on things very well. Um, my concentration is waning. My joints have swollen up. Um, some of the effects I've got to look forward to that really haven't started yet is my hair is going to get brittle and probably break off and fall out. It will grow back, I hope. Um, my fingernails are going to get brittle, bleeding gums, constipation, okay, the, the list is long and story. Basically, they're going to try and get me as close to death as possible, then they're going to zap me with radiation, and then they're going to give me my hormones back, and from all I've read and people I've talked to, pretty much within a few days, I'll come right back to life, but right now I'm on the downhill slide. I am having memory issues, I am having cognition and vision issues. Um, this is going to get weird. <laughs> it really is. I plan to do a video every day or every other day depending on how I feel down this slippery slope. Um, and I will definitely be doing, like I said before, the videos while I am radioactive. I, I'm in my isolation period. That should be interesting. I'm going to be uh, quite radioactive. I'm getting a large dose of radioactive iodine 131. Uh, again, due to my advanced nature of my cancer. Um, thanks everybody for your support. Um, do another video here in a couple of days, and I'm just curious to see exactly what this is going to happen. So here we are, day eight, no thyroid replacement, and I feel like shit. So this could be interesting. Everybody be safe.